East Orange Campus High School has come a long way since head coach Ray Oliver took over in 2017. Many of the East Orange Campus football players have returned home after spending a couple years at private schools such as Morris Catholic and DePaul Catholic. These players chose to come back to EOCHS to win and represent their hometown, realizing that they could get a solid education and prosper out on the field with the recent academic and cultural changes at the school. We always had talent. We always had talent. What we didn't have are the mechanisms to keep them here. So now with our youth programs and our investment in these families, uh, we've been able to keep our kids home. The team has upped their game since Oliver started East Orange campus last season. The Jags finished with a 7-3 record, and this year, there are starters returning in nearly every position. 17 to be exact. One of East Orange's not-so-secret weapons is quarterback Nasir Montgomery. Montgomery finished last season with 2,345 total yards of offense and 27 touchdowns. As one of the top 50 New Jersey football recruits, Montgomery is locked in and ready to dominate as a decision maker. What I've worked on really, I've just been like working out with my track coach, my quarterback trainers just to get better, like, like be a better all-around player, not just a quarterback, like get faster, stronger, be able to do certain things, that like receiver, DB, quarterback, just work on becoming a better athlete because it helps me. Like I don't want to be limited as just a quarterback because then recruitment like, dials down a little bit, so I just want to be able to do everything. That's what I work at. The main goal is really to bring a championship home to the city. I ain't had one in a while, so I'm trying to make it happen this year before we leave. We lost in the first round two, three years in a row. So I wasn't here in my sophomore year, so I, I was at DePaul. But uh, this year we're mainly focusing on how to get out the first round of the playoffs and hopefully get to a championship and win and bring it home for the city. It works all together, like the offensive line, putting in a lot of work. We got a lot of good backs, good quarterback, people that could go out there, catch the ball, a bunch of dogs on the line. Last year, the campus won the conference for the first time in program history. This 2019 season, Coach Oliver has high expectations for his Jaguars. This year, we, we hope to do it again. We're looking, we're working really hard to do that. But obviously, to go further in the states, hopefully win the state championship. Um, you know, the playoff system is a different, it's a whole new season. So you never can guarantee, but I tell you what, uh, nobody's uh, praying and working harder than we are. And hopefully, um, the stars will align and uh, these young men can, uh, can experience what it's like to win the state championship as a Jaguar. Reporting for Jersey Sports Zone, I'm Madison Bess.